Want to learn more about shortening and extending your clips? We've got the answers. Here's a little advanced pro trick for you. We'll begin by going over ripple edits. First, switch to the select tool by pressing A. Then drag some clips to arrange them however you want. Any connections will stay attached as you drag. Blue guides will indicate where you can insert, and the other clips will move to fill the resulting gap. When footage in the timeline is moved forward or backward by an inserted clip, it's called a ripple edit. You can also drag a clip above the primary storyline. When we do this, it will become a connected clip. Dragging footage into the timeline will push subsequent media to the right. This next step is easy. Now, we'll switch to the Trim tool by pressing T. With this, we can perform roll, slip, or slide edits. We'll start with the roll edit, which adjusts the position of the edit point between two clips. We'll select this point here. You can drag the point to the left or right, and both clips will be trimmed accordingly. Now let's do a slip edit. A slip edit allows you to drag through a clip's available media without changing its duration. To do this, drag the middle of the clip left or right. As you drag, you will change the portion of the clip that is being shown. And finally, here's how you do a slide edit. A slide edit allows you to move a clip's position in the timeline without changing the duration of the project. With the Trim tool, hover over the clip you want to slide. Now, hold the Option key and the cursor icon will look like this. While still holding Option, drag the clip to the left or right, and its position will be adjusted. On any of these edits, you can use the Extend Edit shortcut. Position the playhead, select the edit point, then press Shift-X to move the edit point to the playhead. When performing any of these edits, connections will move as well. To prevent this, hold down the tilde key while performing your edit. While dragging a point, it may turn red. This just means that you've reached the end of the available media for that side of the clip. Slide edits, roll edits, roll credits. <laughs> Don't forget to check out Pixel Film Studios, where you can find Final Cut Pro plugins designed for beginners and professionals alike to take your projects to the next level. I can't live without Pixel Film Studios tutorials for Final Cut Pro. I can't live.